This is because Justina Agnieszka Shivali. This is continuation of a prior video. This is what I'm saying. Because often we are forced by non-selective survival to work for free to enable self and others, those that are in suffering, to have a chance to have loved ones not harmed. And so I want to finish that on the loved ones. I have now a list of persons with whom I could not have a friendship, time alone, or a have even a chance to pursue children because of how highly specialized I am. And that is true for many of us. Remember, those persons, including Jemison, Dr. Jemison, are not sick. Those persons are forced to say so, to finish work for a very long time because persons are blackmailed that if pursuing sex and children they will be harmed, dragged up or tortured and persons are blackmailed by having persons killed family members, mothers, fathers uh, and also spouses, spouses and children and so you have to remember that that, that is true for all of us and the assessment that I made for many of you may sound far-fetched, far so information here that you have to include wherever you are, but especially medical practitioners, you have to know this. All of atrocities, presented of atrocities, have a dimension in which they were distorted. So when a person, for instance, from Nazi Germany, when you watch those videos and you, you, you see a woman says, I lost the language or I was not free to speak Polish because I was a Polish uh, person, a woman, and I needed to, I was forced to be pregnant, I needed to go and break out my son from Germany, kidnapped by persons from Germany. And they uh, dressed him and uh, tried to prevent from learning Polish culture and he was, my son, he was unable to uh, be with me or have um, a, um, a, 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 my family uh, last name and uh, um, customs and clothes, so the, uh, presenting the father of the child and that family as perpetrators from the standpoint as a behavior expert and now you need to know there are many of us uh, in uh, outliers that we hide because we are not allowed to uh, reaching certain level to get licensed so we work for free not because somebody impeded that or we were shy but because we can, we have to do enough so that it is implemented and that natural non-selective survival is relieved. But in that example, you have to remember, persons such as that woman, historically, that is the most the likeliest assessment, we were forced to present distorted information for the sake for her of that child and that husband and that German family. That is called a, um, racial, pu racial purity programming. And I developed that on a paper in more accurate way, the same as material from targeted individuals, so that we align history with truth without dismissal of persons who did harm uh, altogether, harm, you know, like torturing and concentration camps and, uh, camps and slavery, but at the same time, when persons lie on purpose to protect well being of the other ones from remote torture or in person torture and acted by persons who do not know about it and are targeted from the above and do an act with other uh, in other the galaxies think of us as if we were lower species as humans the same as we treat cattle or chicken they think of us that because we treat that way animals that's one thing but secondly they they promote and force us to kill and prevent us from cultivating of uh, fruits and vegetables so uh, reserve right to be more uh, compassionate and that is why you have to always know persons who seem inferior especially when you're a buddhist that is not true persons sometimes if you finish educating persons all persons and animals have the same level of uh, capacity for goodness we are being from another galaxy targeted that is sometimes in united states a reason to pursue by a, um, a aviation so all those stamps and s secret uh, better do not speak and the secret missions uh, outside of earth military ones to intimidate aliens archived later on in throwing around spouse of a person in arizona 
it, uh, making that person levitate and then fall, uh, intimidation and things like that. Uh, and I, you know, conclusion that all aliens, all extraterrestrials are bad. A huge um, archive in uh, New Mexico that I've actually had access to and reviewed some of it. You need to know that aliens, extraterrestrials exist, they are real. And secondly, that's one information, so it's not sick to say so, also as mental health or police, it is real, they are real. And sec even if you never saw one, and secondly, they from above, as if satellite, have influence on us, aside non-selective survival. And so then you have to put assertive limits and say like I am saying here now, I will work. And then, when I finish, I reach a reasonable quota of that work, I am assuring you, no matter what it says, how visible those videos are, and how unpaid seemingly I am, I don't have money, but person sometimes provides for me. There will be no information, and no videos, and nothing, no matter if it is a cockroach suffering on behalf of uh, other cockroaches that comes and seeks help, or another dog who speaks some uh, seemingly human language, no matter, but those are apparently many in black, no matter what you will come up with to force me work incessantly, unless I have a chance like everybody else at least to interact and have a date and I send that li a list in Excel with at least one of those persons that I enlisted as loved ones uh, and pursue sexual relationship and own family, I'm not saying I want one, in free will, meaning if that person wants to, and that person has chance to corroborate such, and you keep on pushing me new persons over and over, first of all, I am celibate, there will be no sex with anyone. So uh, take that in mind or in, in person, as a sure, like a non. And secondly, that's not it yet. Secondly, each person that you will prevent to settle me on less, to prevent me from having children, like you've done that to many others during Nazi Germany and also to Dr. Jemison, because her father was a military. You will not obtain any work and any information, I will upload what there is, unless as good faith you will allow us to have what I uh, designed, like those tables, wherever. So I'll be able to meet, for instance, and have a coffee, and persons will stop pretending hating me in public to in person cry or want to hug me or want to hang out. And that is for personal relationships, and that is for me personally. There's a limit. There will be no extortion of work forever. And that is for friendships and for sexual relationships. And again, we are not all gay. That is also clear and now available. And I will introduce that all of that program to high schools and to children. So finishing that, on the war. So a female that on YouTube, she says, my, my son, I was forced to, through programming to not to speak national language. My child was given the name of the father and uh, taken in that family there. So we have to break it out because uh, we had to break uh, that person out because the Germans were bad. In psychology and how mind is constructed, only a man who loved a woman in sexual way and it was reciprocal that ended in pregnancy will result in a female in regression of language that is her language in which persons would force her back on Polish culture to work there or to marry someone there to, for business, for gain or for non-selective survival will develop a version which is common in the United States to speak own language and will forget speaking own language on purpose and prefer only the language of the father of that child, voluntarily so. And so her not speaking Polish was because she was forced to go back and to settle to work or to provide goods for, or sometimes some say pay off, persons from childhood. Be it Jewish or Polish, I don't know. It is common still nowadays. And that is why she did not speak Polish and she uh, did not want to speak Polish. She preferred intimate, especially language of the father of that son. That's all. 
that is true for all and that's how mind is constructed not that she was for maybe she was forced at the same time but that is how the outcome is when you love someone secondly it's because of selfish selfless love i have 10 minutes uh, uh, recording few, five minutes secondly she was also forced to let go of the true reputation of that father and say that he was bad and i know that because my father um, my stepfather, sorry, uh, the father uh, of the um, children that my mother treats us on and married after my father, he was taken hostage, but he was treated as family and provided as family until he was by someone harmed to create an impression that he was tortured and I received so money for it. But if you ask him, he says, I loved the family in Germany and it was, um, they were good to me because possibly one of them was his parent or some family and person disguised as the cleaning personnel worked in Poland to find him. That's why. And so that is all because of sexophobia and that is from also aliens and ex extraterrestrials that we are forced to not to relieve, uh, release that information and release that as relationship, real one, marriage for instance, and pursue work or degradation. Also Ukrainians in Poland are like that to not to have most wanted relationship post divorce prior to divorce and to settle and work childless or having not less wanted children and so who gives last name to a child it's a man that loves a woman so much that her child is all that he has left of her unable to because of external conditions to pursue her as wife and live with him and so those men they took that child or children gave them own last name and life because they loved those children otherwise imagine if i was raped that i was not but i mean not at least in person but if that was the case if i was in person raped and person then uh, in uh, i against disgust with that person and violence i would keep that child and that child would be born would i want to have my own last name or that person who in a disg disgust pursued some sexual ac activity instead of another woman to have that person uh, last name and parade us own around and fight for that child even at expense of war no because that child would remind me of that perpetrator and some persons pursue and harm of those children or hide this is not mine that was very common in uh, nobility on the other hand if persons loved one another and it was by external forces like war and also being targeted out of space most common cause one and the rest one uh, cause and the rest one is actually the the same as uh, animals to humans humans to extraterrestrials you know you know what i'm saying then the pursuit of that child to have last name and to have that person live in the family and be happiest is to teach that person about being the father and loving that uh, little uh, boy for that female and then woman going there to get it back is to bring back the son why that relationship is still real or was and bring back and do the same so that the child has mother and father and only then when woman who loves that kid gives the last name and cares for that child not otherwise not because that uh, was pursuit of harming if such a uh, that kid would be killed and that man in disgust would reject as marked uh, any sort of association with self in the last name included and so you need to remember that from there there is a m misinformation that all persons all germans pursuing the eugenics and things like that hated and all women hated back to assure that for instance brother or father or whoever that is in that area childhood friend in confusion does not accuse and beat up prevented from divorcing persons work and finish that work and that that woman is actually safe accusing those germans and so uh, because they were actually more um, well armed up and that son can come back also under pretenses of false reputation it is wrong to do so it kills but it happens and so non-selective survival now is the final closing message applies to extraterrestrial colonies if we thrive and are most developed and they suffer then they force us to work 
when they reach the same level as us and we prov provide information and uh, uh, help them develop as much as we do and they do at the same time, then there will be no longer remote targeting nor forcing us to be gay, like um, Mr. Traspas uh, reported, having German uh, girlfriend, I believe, that he was uh, or one or, or the other, or uh, only feeding on star energy instead of food, because how long can you feed on freaking star energy also? So remember, the same rules. In cluster, one cluster enables the other cluster.